Hey guys, it's Taku. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Oh, I'm so excited for today's video. This is an unboxing of uh, Tomorrow by Together's Minisode 3 Tomorrow. And you can see here I've got the whole um, signed album set. So I can already tell you right away they signed the album so we don't even have to go looking through for a postcard or anything. I have a Taeyeon signature here for the first one, Subin for the second one, which made me so happy. It's like my first Subin anything. He never comes home and he finally did. And then I have a Hinning Kai uh, for the third version. And we got really close to getting almost a full set because I have another version of the album that is signed by Bumgyu. So I, I had all but Yeonjun, which, you know, I will take. I love getting all of the members' signatures. I think signed albums are so cool. But without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get into it. And I have the three versions. So it's Ethereal. I think this is uh, Promise? No. The third one's Promise. Romantic and then Promise. So we're going to just go in order. And I, I'm, I'm so excited for this. So I have not really taken too much of a peek at like contents for the album and so i'm like i i'm i know kind of like what's in it in terms of but i think there's only like one photo card so we'll we'll get to we'll get to do that when we when we get to it and it's funny because of all the concepts because I, I love all of the concepts for this unit or for this unit for this era guys i'm struggling don't look <laughs> but uh my favorite concept is actually the individual member light because uh, that's where they all have the blonde hair and even though it's it's like a wig which whatever i i still i still think it's like my favorite so i'll have to go collect those later maybe i'll do a video but can we take a moment to appreciate i think this is one of my favorite txt like visual packagings ever i think these albums are so aesthetically pleasing to look at there's a dual texture on the front there's kind of a matte paper here with the the shine and this is the ethereal version and they include this like bookmark kind of strap thing i don't think it's connected to anything so there's the side and i'll go ahead and sweep out any of the contents on the inside because i think they have it all grouped together so let me get those okay i think everything is out now so here is the album and we're just gonna go through it. Yeah, I have not seen people's unboxings of it. There, oh, there's Tan's signature, which is so exciting. Did not realize that this was a slip cover. So you can see the kind of the, the binding there. But yeah, it is actually just a cardboard slip, which I like, right? And here is the ethereal concept which I believe uh, m most of the members agreed that this was their favorite version as well. So it says here, even if we part from each other, let's meet here again. That was the promise we made to each other back when you and I shared one dream. So this album, the story behind it is a boy remembers a promise that he made to, to you, he made to someone, and now he is kind of hoping to reunite with you. And that's why the, the track is called Deja Vu, because when we... When we reunite, it will hopefully feel like deja vu. So that's a little bit about the album. <laughs> I'm slightly more put together this time around. By the way, don't look at my hands. Just I I, I jam my finger in a in a yeah, it's it's not good. But I can see why this is their favorite concept, right? I like how you can spread this all the way open, right? So it's it feels it feels very um loser lover from that era kind of that in a in a mix of of good boy gone bad so there's it's it's got that bad boy energy but it it has a classic rock feel to it you know so and the angel wings are such a lovely touch i love the feathers i think the feathers actually help tie in kind of the grunge look here kind of has like a it has kind of a fallen angel feel to it, which would make sense with the album. Oh, here we go with the guitar picks. Yup. Yup. <laughs> so it was funny because when they were doing the comeback live, this was like, I think this was Bungie's favorite photo. So I can see why. Yeah. And I think, I think uh, Taeyeon also had his favorite photo was 
when he had the guitar pick in his mouth. I don't remember if this was the exact photo, but that's the idea. Okay, that's this is the vision. This is the vision. We're rolling with it. And I like how this is just. I mean, it's like really basic, but I like how it is just a book. Like I can open this all the way. That was one of the things I really praised Temptation for. I love the Temptation album packaging. I like the storybook feel to it. And this feels like kind of a return to that. So I like it. Oh boy. So there's my, there's my bookmark. And it is just a ribbon. I think this would make such a wonderful thing to like tie around uh, an article of clothing tie around like a pant leg, like a, like the loop, the belt loop, or to tie around a light stick when you go on, on tour to see their concerts, because I'm seeing them this summer. I'm freaking out. Oh my God. I'm getting so ahead of myself, guys. This era has just been overwhelming. Not to say that free fall was underwhelming because it definitely wasn't. I, I was living for every, some people I, I was like reading, they were like, didn't really love the whole thing. I actually did like free fall. Um, I will say I kind of liked all the lead up to it more. Like I really enjoyed the the collab songs, the collab tracks, uh, especially back for more. That was like my jam for solid, solid couple months there. But they are, they are on tour, both in concept and in reality. And I actually got tickets and it just, it felt like I was making up for lost time because you guys might remember I did not get Sweet Mirage tickets. I did not even try because it just fell at a really awkward time. So it fell around like kind of like graduation period for a lot of people. And so I'm, I'm guessing I wasn't the only one who struggled with deciding whether to go or not. But Yeonjun, let's, let's cover that up. <laughs> Oh, this is, it, it gives me such like wonderful ideas for like low key how to dress for the concert. Cause I really like this concept, but I like the Prince League. I like the little Prince concept too. So I don't know. I think I'm going to probably go little Prince, but the grunge is definitely more comfortable. Like this, this is very comfortable fitting. So the guitar is so neat as well. The giant wings are, I don't think I've ever seen something like it. It surely has to be a reference to something but I've never seen it. Oh boy. <laughs> this is a lot. I've seen all of the um, Bumgyu and Nana stitchings, all of the people doing their, their magic on social media. And I was like, I was so here for it. Oh, I love it so much. The random like belt that's around the, the fret of the guitar, also the neck of the guitar. I actually really like this shot. I like this one. I like the landscape in the background. Subini. And these are these are dense photo books. Uh, so I'm going to do my best to aggressively flip through these as fast as I can, but I'm not going to skip a page. So, oh, the license plate says tomorrow. Didn't even see that. Ooh, we have a nighttime concept. Oh, that's right. These are they're carrying the I don't know what they're called. They're used at like, I thought they were used more like airport runways or like disaster scenarios, but they're kind of like the hand sparklers. All the members look so good in these concepts though. And I'm glad that it looks like they used time to their advantage. Like this is clearly daytime and that's clearly like evening or nighttime. So I like that about this too. There's a lot of, there's a lot of like naturalness to these concepts. So. My Yanbin didn't get them signed, but I got one. And that is all that counts. That is all that matters. Yeah, these are these are so nice. Any kind of like member running running moments are like some of my favorite photos. Here are the member thanks. So here is Subin's. And here is Yanjun's. Yeah, ah, the styling looks so fun. I really want to, like, I really want to do this as a concept. I feel like everyone is going to do it. Everyone's going to show up and look like Bumgyu. Everyone's going to look like Ethereal Bumgyu. And it'll be the guitar pick in the mouth and everything. I just, I can feel it. Ah, oh, this is, this is incredible. I think this is actually probably my least favorite of the concept photos, though, which is kind of shocking because this is, again, it's like, this is like the member's favorite. 
but it might be my least favorite. I like the discs too. They're very, I don't want to take it out partially because I don't need to, but it's just a matte disc. So there's, ooh, there is the album, which, oh gosh, that opens so weirdly. There we go. I guess that's a problem with this kind of like binding. Oh no, what am I doing wrong? Watch me struggle. Okay. Ugh. I guess it's just going to kind of like wing out like that. So we'll just, I'm actually going to, I'm going to put that up there <laughs> and I'll put this strap with it too. So inclusion time. So we have a poster. So first thing that you get, and I think these are just um, OT5. So it's just a concept photo. Yeah. I like these smaller posters because these are more feasible to hang up. I think anything that's larger than this is like you really have to you have to coordinate it. And I like the star imagery, like the star logo all over it. And then we have a lyric sheet. I haven't even talked about all the tracks, guys. I'll do that maybe with the when I open the next one. So legend. <laughs> Can we talk about her? <laughs> Can we talk about the Morse code track? The Morse code track beating out the, the free fall tracks. I think that's hilarious. So I was like, I was like, what's up with all these little circles? It's just the, the font. So the Killa, Quarter Life, and then the Deja, Deja Vu Animoya re remix. So very simple, but very nice lyric sheet. We have an individual member postcard and I'm curious to see who we're gonna get. And I like that the postage theme makes like a lot of sense with this album. Oh, by the way, I'm going to, I'm going to preface with this. Once you get signed albums, I'm like, I, I, the inclusions kind of mean so little in comparison. Like the signature is everything. Uh, not that I'll ever complain about, you know, my, the only thing I complain about guys is dupes. I don't like pulling dupes for, for members, uh, especially for like similar concepts, but sticker sheet, which again, I actually really like the designs of the stickers. I'm going to try to use these on the tour somehow. We have an individual member sticker thing, which is new. Oh my God, you're gonna hear it. Street traffic, guys, is so bad, is bad where I live. But the bum you stickers. <laughs> and then we have our member PC. So we are hoping again for Subin Yanjun, of course, is my favorite. It's a lot of people's favorite, but I really do like Subin. I try to get Subin postcards when I can, or photo card. And we got, <gasps> hold up. First album I open is Terry. Watch any, watch any Tomorrow By Together album unboxing on this channel and I will pull Taehyung. I really will. He, he, he has to come home. He always does. And at this point I am disappointed and sad if I don't pull him. So, wow, and the guitar pick, this is a good one. This is a good one guys. Again, never gonna complain. And the lighting is really awful. I'm sorry, that's why I keep moving it back and forth. We have number two. <laughs> this is so fun to just rapid fire through, but yeah, it is. It is. It is the the Terry curse, and it's not a curse. It's it's a blessing. It really is. But I think it's so funny how every time, like, because I don't always, I don't always like haul signed album sets. Like this is this is a lot for me. Um, I am happy to even just get a couple albums, and so yeah, for it to be the signed album. And then I get his photo card on the first one. That's magic. That right there is magic. But this is the one that I was so debating on whether to even open this. I wanted to just leave it in the plastic because that Subin signature is just everything to me. It's a beautiful signature and I just frame this forever. But the orange is vibrant. This is like the main album color. This is the romantic concept. So here is, by the way, the side. So it starts to spell a word, wonder what it says, right? Minisode three. I think the Minisode, like naming it tomorrow is very confusing because their name is already tomorrow by together. So that was an interesting choice. But, oh, inclusions, let me sweep these out of the way. So if I can feel where they are at. Okay, let's get to it. So I have no idea who's we got. I'm trying to remember which one the romantic concept is. So again, there's the inside. I like this, by the way. Again, I really like this album. This is, it's a really easy album to flip through. Oh, that's right. This is the castle one with the, the glass. 
So I'm guessing this says the same thing every time. Castle concept is cool, though. You know I appreciate um, TXT as kings. My TXT kings. My TXT princes. And this is specifically like Little Prince, right? Which I did read. I reread. Reread in preparation for this whole album. But, guys, the corset, the lace, the black rose. It also just got really dark all of a sudden. So, apologize for that. Yanjun, though, with the shorts. Oh, and the, the purple, um, the purple shimmer. Is that, like, purple on the rose, too? Oh, you're kidding me. Yeah, I, I, I think this is maybe my second favorite one. It feels so classic, uh, like, when you think of, like, classic, like, Romeo and Juliet. That's what this feels like to me. Wow, okay. Oh my gosh, this is exciting. Yeah, I apologize. We're using natural lighting as almost always we do and I'm losing sun. So I'm trying to go through this. Yeah, the, this is, yes. <laughs> the purple shimmer, I like it so much. I think it's such a nice touch. I think I'm gonna have to do that honestly if I go on to if I go like to when I go to the concert I think everyone's going to I think it'll be so fun yeah like this this is a concert fit this is I think closer to my speed I think this is gonna be so uncomfortable and it will be the summer so everyone will be sweating like crazy but how fun you know wow that is just I am I'm am starstruck by TXT. Every single time they do they do concepts, they're always so nice. TXT photo books are some of my favorites to look through, and that's not just because I'm biased toward the group. I really do I really do like the the photos and the concepts. So This kind of has like a Sleeping Beauty uh theme to it. I don't know, I could be wrong. The way they're holding the roses. Is Sleeping Beauty the rose? Or is that Beauty and the Beast? I don't know. But yeah, it's like it's like they're in a casket. So. Wow. They look so tall in these concepts too. And I know TXT are giants, but like sometimes they look minimized, but they look they look tall in this. It's just so elegant, so graceful. I get why it's called romantic now. So, and following the comeback was also very fun. Like I haven't been this excited for a comeback in a minute. So like following all of this really was, that is such a good photo. <laughs> oh my gosh, Kai. But following this comeback really was, it really was. It really is because we're still, we're only like one week in. So. I'm just, I'm in love. I'm in love with the whole thing. Oh my God. Wow. Look at this photo, guys. Visual bung you. My visual, my visual kings. Wow, that is crazy. This Yanjun photo also, when they uploaded this one online as like one of the major concept photos. Crazy. I really do like all of it. I really do. I haven't talked enough about the track, so I, I probably should. Okay, so the first one, um, oh, I'm like forgetting the name. It has tomorrow in it. Like, come see me tomorrow or something like that. Uh, but I think it's a fun opener. I think it's a, it's a fun way to, you know, come see me tomorrow. It's like, it, it gets you really excited and then deja vu makes you sad. <laughs> and then deja vu hits you with the the feelings immediately right after and then the, the album after that is more or less kind of kind of optimistic i don't know but you have what is it you have a maknae line subunit song you have uh yan bin oh my can we please can we slow down for just a second uh yan yan bin in killers I'm being killed. Song that song also the lyrics on that song. Don't look it up. 
It is it is from the Little Prince. Like I can actually I'm gonna be one of those annoying Moa that's like the tame me reference is the little prince. <laughs> Cause that is what that's what the the fox says. They see the fox and the fox is like, oh will you tame me? Because I believe, if I have this correct, it comes from a French like in English we don't really have a word for what it means. Honestly, a closer word is just basically to like to love me. Like will you be will you love me? And yeah, they, they a lot of the English translation is will you will you tame me? And so I didn't write it. I didn't translate it. Wow, he looks incredibly thin here. <laughs> My vanishing man. But oh, see what I mean by these photo books are long though. I feel like we've been flipping through this forever, like in a good way. This is like one of those like <laughs> old time like married couple stand photos where you have them like up here like grandma grandpa or like aunt and uncle i love the long hair though i'm glad he got to keep it for the concept photos and then hinning kai with the light color that blonde is so pretty it definitely it makes me want to color my hair again don't know though definitely growing it out a bit but i don't know what i want to color it okay we are at the end so here is Subin's. Here is Yanjun. Again, I feel like I'm going through these really fast, but. Oh, wow. Bookmark was there at the very end. I don't know if they place these in random spots or if it is the same every time. But here are the credits. And, ooh, they have a rose on this one. I didn't even check that the, that the decal was different or the design was different. I like that. Yeah. And then here's, of course, the strap again. So do something fun with it. I think, yeah, tying it around a light stick would be really fun. So ooh, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to figure out how this works because it's, it kind of doesn't want to. Yeah. Okay. So there's the album. And now we have the poster. So let's see which photo they ended up going with. Ah. An excellent choice, balcony photo, <laughs> where they're all staring down at you. Imagine hanging this like high up in your room so that TXT can just look down at you. Oh my gosh, they would, TXT would, and I would let them. So here is the lyric. So let, let's talk just a little bit more so I can get these names right so I don't look like a fake fan. I'll see you there tomorrow, that's it. I was like, I'm singing the lyrics. Uh, yeah, it's a really fun opener, I really like it. Uh, and then, of course, you have the Morse code here, which you will have to type for yourself what it spells out. Because I know what it spells out. And very nice throwback to their very first album. It feels like everything come full circle with this album. It almost feels like deja vu, you know? <laughs> okay, that's a bit cheesy, but you guys get what I mean. So, yeah, Miracle. And I can't remember, is this the subunit song? No, this one's not. This is, I think this is all of them. I'm trying to remember which one's the killer. Qu was it Quarter Life? Maybe Quarter Life was the subunit song. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, uh, killer I really like. It's, it has the same energy as uh, Tinnitus or Tinnitus, however you pronounce it, from Temptation. So same kind of beat, same kind of lower lower sound I don't know it's it's like a hollowed sound I really like it and then it allows the Subin's falsettos to shine and wow that is loud outside guys I apologize and then quarter life is it's a little more anthem -y and I like it so and then of course I this song abruptly cuts I will say that quarter life uh, it kind of has an abrupt cutoff and it, the whiplash is 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 insane on, on it so I'm glad that remix is actually there at the end to like neatly tie everything together and our individual member is <gasps> Princely Bum Q with the long hair. Wow. Truly a, a, a gorgeous, uh, gorgeous concept. It's I, I'm so envious of this, like the clothing even. And then we have the same sticker sheet. My individual member stickers are <gasps> Yanjun. Which again, I don't think I'll ever use these, but I don't think I ever could. I don't. I don't know how Moa uses uses the stickers, but wow. And then photo card again, Subin Yanjun, Subin Yanjun. We're gonna see who we got though. 
Okay, I thought there was a pearl effect to it. There's not. It's just white. Okay, ready? <gasps> Hinkai with the rose. Oh, this is such a good photo too. Wow. I like the... Uh, it doesn't look super washed out, you know? Like some, like a lot of like K-pop like filters will look really washed out. And this one doesn't. This one looks like natural lighting or like the natural color of the makeup. And I... I like that. Okay, so we're not getting like my favorite memories for photo cards, but the photos that we're getting are really good. These are good PCs, guys. And then I have one more album. So, uh, the other ones had some slack at the top, so I don't know how to, oh, my knife is so dull. That was gross. <laughs> that gave me ick. <laughs> I didn't like that. I'm sorry. You had to see that. Uh, yeah, that was bad. Uh, so I need to sharpen that or just get a new one. So here is the, the third album. And I have seen this one. I have seen kind of the cons or not just the concept, but I have like seen a flip through of this album. So here is the side. And then here is the back. So this is the promise version right up there. So yeah, let's just... We're just gonna, oh, inclusions, because I'm gonna forget this every time. So let's see. Everything is, I think I got everything. Now I did. Okay. That poster is really like the size of it. So signed by Hinning Kai. So that's really cool. And now we're gonna open it. And the cream, like the beige here, it's brown, I guess. It's this is brown. But I really, it looks. On camera, it's picking up as a very warm color, but in person, it's a very cool toned brown. So don't let it fool you. It's a, it's like a, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know why this looks so, looks so bright. It looks, it looks much creamier, much warmer in person. Um, this one to me, I know, what are they calling it? Promise? Yeah, they're calling it the Promise version because it has that same feeling of like waiting at a train station for someone. But it's definitely like, Little Prince inspired. I remember translating that. It's something in French and it's lovely. I think it's actually something something related to that. Oh my god! But the makeup in this one, this is my favorite Subin one, and I see I understand why it was his, um, photo wise. So yeah, it, lots of and lots of interesting lore pieces coming together. Like they really do look like princes just ripped out of kind of a fantasy world and put in reality i think this is kind of what the the energy that free fall has you know just crash landing from neverland and just really like you know reaching i don't want to say like the end of youth but like you know they're definitely no longer teenagers and so just facing that reality is is tough is tough and the cinched waist is also tough you know but the little, the cape, the details, the, yeah, that sensation of just like waiting for someone who may or may not show up. It's just so sad, but lovely and incredible to look at. This is giving Dune, Loki. This is, this is actually, um, we're going to keep moving on because <laughs> I could sit here and look at these forever. Oh my gosh. And then you have the, the fox mask. So I do wonder why... It, I only see it with some of the members, unless everyone does have it. But the crowns are also different, so the the attention to detail is so it's so chef's kiss. And yeah, I don't know. Train stations, bus stops as concept photos are also some of my favorites. So you can see in the background though where there's a there's an interesting like lore piece there where you have all of the album like eras. So you have like star uh what came after star oh my god magic geez uh eternity blue hour and then at at uh freeze it branches off into two paths so there's fight and escape and then thursday's child or it goes temptation and i just like when i saw that my brain actually like broke <laughs> i i i'm like not super hardcore into lore but i i'm deep in it and in enough to know that like when they give you a timeline that's kind of a big deal. So yeah, I don't, my camera is not picking it up very well, although it's also very small in the photos. I wonder if there's a better one later. 
So focus for me, focus. These look like parking garage photos. Okay, now we're back up top. Subin, uh, wow, and all of the, all of the belts also. I like the star netting here. I just uh, the the details are so nice. Here we go. Wow, why didn't I just show you guys this one? Okay, so if you are a lore nut like I am, that's exciting. And then of course three hundred four. So. Ba -ba -bum. Wow, Bumgy's photos are really good. They all look so good, but he is working that camera, let me say. Oh, we're coming up to Subin has whoops. Subin has a favorite photo in this photo book, and it, it's at the end and it's devastating. It it like it almost doesn't even look like him. That's crazy. This is this would bias wreck anyone, I think. I feel they would bias wreck anyone. Yeah, I like the Yanjun with with the cape. Okay, my bookmark just fell out. <laughs> so, mm, the glow is so... Oh my god, I'm just realizing he has like a long cape. Kind of feels like a vampire, but obviously not. Oh, I am... I'm going to have to go so slowly with this. We're getting closer to the devastating Subin photo, guys. It's coming. <laughs> I swear it's coming. Man, they just look so... That is so lonely, cat. That is so lonely, fox. Wow. It is just kind of a lonely photo shoot in general. Like, all, all of the concepts. So, I guess they're waiting for you, you know? They're waiting... They're waiting for someone. So, you kind of have to be lonely with it. And then the first concept was literally just rock and roll. <laughs> we grow ever closer. Guys, these photo books are long. You are getting your money's worth with these, I tell you. I also like the train tracks. That's that's a nice detail too. Here it is. <laughs> oh, it's Subin's favorite photo, and it's definitely mine as well. Wow, that face on camera, but also with the like the the blush, and I think there's like fake freckles, and then the blue contacts, and just the pouty lips. The whole thing. It does remind me of Good Boy Gone Bad when they were crying. <laughs> I think it was fake tears. I don't think it was real, but crying in one of their. Um, concepts I'm just I'm so magnetically drawn to this concept though I I really do think that this one maybe is my favorite of the three uh but then of course I like the light concepts so like the individual album members I'll definitely be picking those up I just wish that that was in a photo book because it's so hard to go out and justify buying like five different albums you know so I might just I might try my hand at one or two that way I can have the, cause that one, that one feels the most little prince. Like if this is like the little prince in reality, the, the other one is like the little prince truly being magical. Cause they meet in a field of golden grains. So, oh, and then we got the star. So I can turn this around a little bit. It's actually pretty tight in here, which is a good thing. So there's the disc, here's the back and Oh, that one closed a lot easier than the others. Maybe it's because I didn't bust the spine open. So, yeah, this... I like this version a lot. Um, I like all of the versions, but... Yeah, oh, actually, I do like all of them. I don't know. I think the solution is simply to just get all of them, you know? <laughs> Easy fix. Is this a vertical poster? Oh, it is! I love vertical posters. I like vertical posters more than horizontal ones. So, yeah, this is... This is all... This is good. This is great. And the, the, the soft blue glow complements all of the orange everywhere so nicely. So, yeah. I saw the, the tweet where Moad like, took a bite, like a fake bite out of Yanjun's mid, mid, mid riff area. <laughs> that is so funny. I might have to do the same just, just because. So, and now we have the same uh, album track list. It's, such, it's a good album. It's a, it's a great album. This one feels more in line as a sequel to temptation than i think freefall did although i like freefall so can't go wrong with any of it and then here is the promise postcard let's see who we got <gasps> oh my god anytime i get yanjun anything it's like it's it jump scare this is a jump scare wow 
he does kind of look like a like I know he's like the fox uh, emoji, but he kind of like there there's a fox energy to it, and the crown is so pretty. I like the lighting. Oh, this is so nice. And then stickers, which are the same. And then our individual stickers are. <gasps> we got Yunjun as well. Wow, we got Yunjun album. Can we hope for a Yunjun photo card? Let's make it happen. Yeah, Yunjun midriff sticker. <laughs> okay. And here's is my photo card. Ba -ba -ba -bum. <gasps> oh my God. It's Bunk You. It's me. I'm Bunk You. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this is such a good photo too. The contact's a little wonk. It, it always happens to you. I don't know why. But this is such a good photo. Oh my gosh. So, I, I'm... This one's a good one. I'm not going to complain at all. So, but I, I do have one more thing before I bring it all back together. And that is... I'm just going to do the... I'm going to open this one for the the inclusions. So we get one more bonus round, which is exciting. Guys, someone want to like, someone want to donate a new knife to the channel? That would be so great. It works so hard. It has been working for me since I think I have had that, that tiny little uh, thing since like maybe even before high school. So probably a decade old if not older than that has it even been a decade since i've been out of high school no it hasn't not even close i don't know what i'm saying i'm not that old okay shiny 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 love it love it love it bungu signature mm. and then our inclusions i think we're just gonna flip to it are you ready actually i lied we are gonna do this one at a time postcard is Oh no, we got a dupe. That's okay. Bumgu is my sister's bias, so I'll be able to give this to her and she'll really like it. I'm okay with that. Also, it's the Bumgu signed album, so it's meant to be. So, and then stickers. Stick. Oh. Individual stickers. Taeyun. Who did we get before? I. Did we get Yanjin before? Yeah, I, did. I really pulled two Yanjin sticker sets. Okay. So that's exciting, but we got well, <laughs> the exact photo. What are the odds? Okay, and then here we go, guys. Photo card, photo card, photo card, and <laughs> oh, my sister is gonna destroy me for this. Oh, not the bungie with the rose. But here's the deal, because she pulled Subin in the individual album, like the PC for it. So I think I will have to actually trade her. Uh, even though she was going to give it to me for free. But this is a devastating photo card. I think, I dare say, I dare say, bum toadies, this might be like the best photo card ever because that rose is so voluminous and the natural color and the hair and the smile. In the Bumgu signed album, less, no less. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I it's, it's always a mess doing these signed albums because they're always such long videos, but I'm very grateful for you guys all for... For watching it and uh do stick around subscribe uh if you want to see more like this because i'm going to come on here and probably do some individual member txt albums not just mini so three but also free fall i have two that i bought maybe a third so if you want to see more uh txt stuff it's coming all right <laughs> stream the album go love it and till next time